Hi guys, it's Kelly and Ismira with Coldwell Baker Rocks Realty. We are continuing our January new year, new home, new build series with you and we are on location today. We are on location at Mountain View Estates, close to the I-8 off of Arica Road. Yes. So behind us, let me move out of the way. This is some 3D printing going on. I don't know if you've heard of 3D printing homes, but who's building out here? So it is with Century Complete. It's kind of some really cool new technology. They set up these big frames and it is a robotic, robotically printed home made out of concrete composite. Mm -hmm. So their, their claim is that they're more sustainable, mm -hmm. more energy efficient, yep. and it does it takes a fraction of the time to complete the home from start to finish. So one of the one of the fun facts that I read is that if from start to finish they could build a small home in 24 hours. Typically they're doing it in phases, like Kelly was saying, but they could do a home in 24 hours if needed, but the process is a little bit different. Mm -hmm. So what the th 3D printer is doing is it's doing all of the walls and then after the fact, the laser's going through and it's cutting out the windows and the doors. Right, so they have different tools right. that they put on there. So the first tool is the builder, so it builds right. that composite to do the walls all around. Mm -hmm. And then you're like, well, where are all the windows and the doors? Right. <laughs> well, then they attach another tool yep. and it's the cutter tool. Yep. And it cuts out windows, doors. It also cuts out where the electrical is gonna be fed through. Mm -hmm. Then they put another tool on there that creates the texture uh, that you'll see. And it just kind of kind of goes along the lines of that. And they do have one house. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's behind, it's this one right here. Uh, am and I it's, blocking? It's, com <laughs> it's completed, and I'll tell you, it's beautiful. It I is. mean, it, it's beautiful. They, mm -hmm. You can't tell a difference just by the naked eye, you know, yeah. looking at it. The houses look ideally the same, it's just a different building process. Exactly. So over here, we have workers, and what are the workers doing? Well, it looks like these ones are actually building the roof. Mm -hmm. So the roof is a traditional style with the two by fours, the two right. by sixes, uh, with the workers. And then where the machine is, those guys are just kind of observing and making right. sure the process is going through smoothly. So these yeah. ones in this, they start, their starting price is around 279 mm -hmm. for a home. And these are bigger lots. We were trying to figure out, I think they're either third acre or half acre lots, but you do get a bigger lot out here. No HOA. We've got CG Mountain right over here. Beautiful, too, beautiful view. The side of us. Mm -hmm. and yeah, we actually stay tuned because we are heading to a completed home. Yes. So you can go inside and see what one of their completed homes looks like. All right. Hi guys. So we are in Toltec in Eloy. We are actually in one of the 3D printed homes right now. We're in a 3D printed yeah. home and it's beautiful. It really is. We're going to give you a little tour. Hold on. Okay, so we're walking through the front door. Here's one of the bedrooms. Look how cute this is staged. Hallway going all the way down. You're gonna have your garage to the left. Yeah, garage right there. Another bedroom here. Actually, I missed the bathroom. Yeah, bathroom. So bathroom here. Bedroom. Should have yeah. turned on this one. Hi. <laughs> this is what I do when I'm showing houses. I can see myself. <laughs> <laughs> Separate laundry. Nope. The primary bedroom in here. Look at this. Walk in closet. One of the things Century Complete does really well is utilize their space. They don't have the largest homes, but they get really creative with their floor plans mm -hmm. and they get you the most um, use out of the space that you have here. So they, have, they do that really, really well. We were acknowledging the kitchen and living room area and the way they have this staged is just really cool because you might take a look at this space and be like, man, where am I going to put my couch? Yeah, perfect. But look at that. I mean, that's, yeah, it's very cute. And the kitchen as well, there's no island here, but you could put a... You could put something. You could, you yeah. could bring your own island in there, mm -hmm. but it's really cute in person. Very, very cute. It really is. 
And these lots here in Toltec, look at how big this lot is. Look how much space you have. Let's go check it out. Huge lot. Sorry guys, operator. <laughs> no, someone left it unlocked. Whoever was here first. <laughs> it wasn't us. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Yeah. All right, who wants to move to Arizona? Beautiful day. Oh, yeah. It's January. It's January and you can wear shorts with a hoodie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> shorts with a hoodie. <laughs> All right. These walls are really thick in this 3D home, and listen to this. <laughs> look at that. Nothing's hollow. <laughs> look at this. And yeah, so look at this window seal. Yeah. It's really thick. Yeah, I mean, it, it adds like this extra character to it. I think it's really attractive. It really is. Okay. So we smear found some fun facts. Fun facts about 3D printed homes. Kelly, mm -hmm. do you know where the first 3D printed home was built? Well, I know you told me. <laughs> <laughs> but I forgot. <laughs> oh, that was a gimme, Kelly. I know. <laughs> it was in Austin, Texas. Oh, Austin, Texas. The, the first 3D printed community is in Southern Mexico. Okay. The largest 3D printed building is a two-story office space in Dubai. Hmm, two-story. And NASA plans to build 3D colonies on Mars through the 3D printed Habitat Challenge. Wow. Might want to fact check that one, but. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this has actually been quite the fun adventure. Yes. Thank you for watching and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.